Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back, Force here, and today we'll be taking a look at 10 million. This is a fast-paced match 3 game similar to titles like Puzzle Quest, Dungeon Raid, and Bejeweled. The game was developed by ADA Games and originally released for mobile devices, although a PC version is now available via Steam, and that's what we'll be looking at here today. Uh, I do want to start off with a tutorial though, just to give you a basic introduction, and the other reason is, if I were to try to explain things while playing the actual game, I'd fail super hard. In fact, I'll probably still fail super hard. <laughs> Alright, so you can see slide to create a match, matching swords will attack enemies. So you've got a match three, it's a match three game. Matching three of particular tile will do a certain thing, so matching three swords will do a basic sword attack to the enemy. Next little thing here, matching stabs will perform a magical attack, matching backpacks and kill enemies to find items. So I gotta match stabs here to perform a magical attack. And let's see here, match keys to open chest and doors. Chest can contain gold and items. So I've gotta match three keys now to unlock one, and that is one lock. I've gotta match three keys another time to unlock the next one. Uh, this one over here, there we go, okay. Now that also gave me an item, a skeleton key. You can see experiment with different items. The skeleton key will unlock two locks automatically. So if I do the skeleton key, bam, two locks, done. And th th this is how you play the game. You, you make your way through the dungeon at the top there, and you've got to basically, using the tiles, try to get past your next obstacle. So you can see here, getting hit and standing still gives a time penalty. Killing monsters, opening chest, and running grants a time boost. Obviously time boost is what you want, because if you run out of time, it's the end of that run. All right, so we got to kill this guy right here, so we're going to do a couple of those attacks. Let's get a few sword attacks in. How wonderful. Next thing here, uh, run complete. You can run, run a run last until you run out of time. Run for as long as possible. Okay, so we're going to attack this guy here. Got a couple of, uh, couple of basic attacks there. Why don't we get a sword attack in? Excellent. And shield counters right here. If I match shields, it gives me a shield point. Uh, enemies hitting me will reduce the shield counter instead of my time, if that is the case. And I don't know that I even have any shields to match, so I'm just going to try to take out. Oh, there we go, got some shields to match right there. And we can actually, there. Okay, next one. Matching wood and stone to repair and upgrade your castle, which we'll take a look at in a moment. Uh, so you get uh, wood and stone by matching those tile sets here. You can also get gold by completing objectives and experience by killing monsters. Those are basically the currencies within this game to acquire upgrades uh, that we'll be taking a look at right when we're done this. Okay, so more matching here. Let's try to take him out. Do some weapon rematching, match some stones here. It's important to keep moving. Uh, keep the board rich in swords, stabs, and keys. Keep the board clear of wood and stone and make sure you're ready for anything. So it's important in between obstacles to make sure you're clearing stone and wood because those aren't going to help you in a fight or trying to unlock a chest. So in between basically monsters or chests or doors, I'm trying to clear stone and wood. That's the objective anyway. And let's see, a nice stab attack right there. That's intense. I probably also get some shields in between uh, fighting monsters. Getting shields will help obviously, again, reduce the time. Subtracted, uh-oh, I don't have can't see, oh, here we go, okay, we have a match right there. That is the end of the round, wonderful. Top tip, if you reach the end of the corridor, you'll get a bonus, but continue running. Okay, so, wonderful. We have completed the tutorial to the game, now I can show you the castle. So this is the castle where your guy starts off in, and there's essentially various upgrade points. So we'll go to this first one right here. Uh, this upgrade point allows you to increase your effectiveness, uh, let's see, 10%, Weapon damage back when attacked, 10% stone and wood from matching, reduce the cost of upgrades. So you can see I can spend some experience to get these various upgrades here. Um, and I've already trained a bunch of upgrades, although there's still quite a few that I can unlock. Let me get items do 20, uh, yeah, let me get items do 25% more damage. That's a good one. I'll grab that. And I'll also grab, uh, deal 10% weapon damage back when attacked. That's a good one too. Okay, wonderful. So that's most of my experience. Can't get any more right now. Uh, there's various levels of each one of these. The trainer here currently at level two. The rest of these here are at level one. Let's take a look at this one right here. This is the blacksmith, allowing me to increase my weapons. You can see I've got a bunch of gold here. So I can upgrade weapon sharpness by spending 500. So why don't I go ahead and do that? And now my weapon is a bit sharper, doing a little more critical hit damage. 
And again, this is level one, I could upgrade it to level two, and you do that just by continuing along the upgrades cost of wood and stone. Uh, this one right here, let's see, upgrade staff material, upgrade staff quality, why don't we do that? Spend a little bit of gold. And now we can do more damage with our staff attack. So there's a progression system within this game through this castle system. And I'll show you this over here. There's the dilapidated room. Let's go ahead and repair this. I've got the rank, required rank and the required cost. And now we've got access to this room, which is upgrading shields. Upgrade shield type, shield material, shield size. And then lastly, we have this room down here. There's still that one that needs to be unlocked. I don't think I've got enough for that. Uh, this one is reduced damage, upgrade armor and stuff. So yeah, a little bit of character progression. It is pretty cool. This costs too much and I'm not the required rank. So we first took a look at the tutorial. Let's go ahead and take a look at the uh, second level now. So the first one was rookie. And as you progress, you get a higher score multiplier as well as a resource collection multiplier. So we started off with rookie. Next uh, level here is Wayfarer. So why don't we go ahead and run that dungeon. So I'm just going to show you a few of these. I mean, I think you guys uh, pretty much get the basic idea. It's it's a simple match three game with a caveat of uh, you're, you're against... You've got to actually pay attention to the top. You know, you can't just be constantly staring at this to try to match three. You got to see, hey, what's my objective here? What am I trying to uh, overcome? What am I trying to get past? Do I need keys? Do I need to lock those? Et cetera, et cetera. Uh, match those up. This is incredibly hard while commentating. I have to... <laughs> I have to tell you too, I realized before making this video, I'm like, this is going to be sloppy because I'm, I'm trying to pay attention to like talking to you guys on top of everything else. This is not going to go well whatsoever, but it's, it's okay. It's still fun and it's going to give you guys, a, a, again, a good basic idea as to what this game is all about. Match some of those to get some items. We can use this item here. It's going to do a lot of damage. Look at that. Match some swords there. Do this again. Uh, wonderful, wonderful. Um, got a key here. So match those up. I got those right there. Match those. Oh, I just lost myself a key row, but I've got that one right there. Excellent, excellent. Uh, baddie, take him out. In between, try to match, get, get rid of some of those. Uh, again, trying to get rid of the wood and the stone in between rounds is uh, pretty, pretty important. And I'm getting myself some shield count as well. Obviously, it does not hurt. In fact, it helps. <laughs> okay. Um, all right, so he's been eliminated. Excellent. And now we're at another one of these. Do I have any obvious? No, I do not. I'm going to use a key because I've got a ton of those in my item storage. So here's experience, wood, uh, stone, and gold that you have. We've got another one of these. So why don't we just use that? And then it also shows your shield right there, which, again, is depleted uh, when I hit enemies if uh, I have some shield storage. In storage, what is this? Storage wars. Okay, we're gonna go up there. <laughs> Match that one. I uh, got another item here. Throw that at that fool. There you go. And uh, I think I probably have some stone to match, but yeah. all right. Let's see. You got a key. Use that key right there. Wonderful, wonderful. Warning. Uh oh. I've been warned. This is where we're going to start to lose pretty badly here. In fact, oh my gosh, I can't even think right now. Match some of those. Yeah, this is over. This is over. We got that. That's the end of the run. Top tip, with great power comes great responsibility. Now, normally when you first make your way through these, you've got objectives to go through. If, if you've completed them like I have here, they're no longer showing. So we're going to return home. We could just rerun that. Uh, and in all of that process, we've gained some experience. We've gained some uh, some wood and some stone. And we've gained some gold. Now, let me try to let me go over here, use some of my experience. Let me see what else. Do those all, okay, that, I think that this, the center one's the only one that actually uses experience. I think everyone else requires gold. Pretty sure that required gold as well. So we're gonna use some experience here to level up 10% stone and wood for matching, wonderful. And um, go back down and we will run the next one now. So I'm not gonna show you too, too much of this game again. I just wanted to give you guys a basic idea as to what this is all about. It's pretty addicting. Um, it's a, it's a, definitely a pretty addicting match three game. And the reason I wanted, oh my Lord, super fail already. The reason I wanted to take a look at this uh, today is because I've heard a lot of good things about this game. It's, it's a 2011 release. It's just now coming to PC, but it, it's a game that was released last year. And I heard a lot of really good things about it. So I thought, man, I should really show that. Uh, now that it's on PC, I should show that to my subs. So that's what we're doing here. 
And trying to match. Uh, gar, 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 gar. Needed a key. That's not the way I need to go. There we go. This is not good at all. Ugh, of course, we need another key now. I'm trying to match some other things. There we go. Match that up now. And bring myself, get myself some shields there. Go through some stone. If you could get some, you see what I mean? I can't even, I can't, I can barely play this game without talking to you guys. I'm trying to do it. <laughs> All right, try to get that matched up and no, oh, come on. Ugh, fail. <laughs> but this will happen a lot, you know, you'll, you'll be consistently going through and sometimes you'll you'll get a really good run and you'll get a lot of matches. Sometimes the matches will just suck pretty terribly and uh, and you're having a hard time getting through as a result. So that'll happen. That will happen, my friends. That will happen. Let's go ahead and take him out there. We can eat this to give ourselves some more time. You can see that pushed us a little bit further down. And of course now, there we go. Got some matching over here. And why do I have like all of those? Uh, key, go do that. Thank you. Get some wood matched over here. Um, okay, I got some of that, but I don't want to do that yet. I got a key match right there. That is a double. Thank you much. And got a key match right there. And we've got another key match right here. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Another key match, fantastic. Got that right there. Do some fire damage. I'm not sure if you do decrease fire damage to the fire guys. That would make a lot of sense if that were the case though. So I wouldn't be too surprised. Let's try to match that right there. And okay. No, I can't, I can't find any. I can't find any. Oh, this is not working for me. Magic key, go. Magic key, run. Run faster, forest, run. This this will be the last uh, this will be the last level. That is that's the end of that. I can't even I don't even know what's going on. We took him out really. Just just please be merciful and end this now. I don't want to. I mean, come on, people don't. They've seen enough. <laughs> you guys you guys have seen enough. Right, that's it. I'm I'm done. Throw a tomahawk at him. I don't know. All right, guys. Well, I, I guess I'll wrap up this look here at 10 million. The match three game, very fast paced, again, similar to titles like Puzzle Quest, Dungeon Raid, and Bejeweled. It's now available on the PC. I think it was $5, or it might be like $4.99 or something like that, but pretty inexpensive. And if you like match three games, this is pretty cool. I like the twist of, you know, having to pay attention to more than just the board. You're not only looking at the board, you're looking at the top, you're seeing what your obstacle is, you're trying to match against that. Uh, it's a lot of fun. Definitely don't try to commentate while playing this game as if anyone would besides me. All right, guys, that, that's going to do it. Thank you so much for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed this look at 10 million currently available on Steam, or you could just get the mobile version as well on your phones or I suppose your iPads. Thanks so much for watching. If you like the content, please subscribe. And as always, keep watching and keep owning. Now right, I'm going to do this one more time. Come on, dungeon. I got it. All right, let's see here. Match the shield. Get some stone matched over here. And this is a chest. I'm going to match the chest. Pretty cool soundtrack. I like the little music they got going on here. Kind of nifty. Where did my guy go? There you are. All right, let's see here. Get rid of the stone. And matching swords. Matching swords. Are you serious? Don't. Don't. Uh, uh, there's. Are you serious? There we go. That's a set. That took me. <laughs> that took me far too long. And this one will too. Ugh. Oh, this is not good. I'm dead, Zors. Match that. Thank you. Come on. Attack with weapons. Attack with weapons. There's no weapons to attack with. No, get him!